New tonight at 11, Cropper County is in dark red on the CDC map, indicating high transmission rates, one of four counties in the entire northeast United States. Yeah, an unwanted designation, to say the least, that has Crawford County in the uh, COVID crosshairs. For some, that could mean putting face masks back on. Julia Hazel joining us now in the control room with much more. Julia. Good evening, Sean and Joe. Now, the recommendations announced by the CDC say that Fully vaccinated individuals should wear a face mask indoors in public, and that's why it's such a high concern in Crawford County because they are in dark red and the only one in our area. To wear a mask or not to wear a mask, that is a question for workers and business owners, especially in Crawford County since it's considered a high transmission area by the CDC map. However, for this owner of a tuxedo shop, she wants to do what she can to keep people in her community protected. I'm cautious. I saw the map. I saw that we're a big red dot in Pennsylvania, which doesn't make me very happy. Um, I'm fully vaccinated, but I know that there's plenty in our county that are not. People in the service industry say it's worth wearing a face mask again to keep everyone safe. I, I am feeling fairly strong that I'll put the sign back on my door and just I, I have masks here available for people. Personally, I would absolutely wear a face mask again and I think that it's a good idea. I think it kept everybody safe the first time around and I think it is probably the only way that we know how to keep people safe. Even though Smith believes masks are a safe option, the transition could be hard for customers. Last year was known as the COVID summer. This year is like now we now we get to hug each other again. So it's definitely going to be tricky. It's going to be very hard. But I think if that's the case, if it's if we're in high risk here, then it might be a good idea to go ahead and mask back up. Currently, this is only a recommendation from the CDC. There is no current mandate in place to wear face masks. The Crawford County Commissioner says there is still no determination at this time about enforcing the mask. And if you to see if you are in a high transmission area, head to our website at yourerie.com. Sean. Yeah, and as we said, there are not many of them, just two in Pennsylvania. Yes. All right, thank you, Julia.